Jesse, it's been a minute since we've talked about AI. We saw an interesting article from one of our research providers. Yeah, yeah. Funstrap pointed out uh, this this tweet from a Julian. I'm not going to try and say his last name, but we dug pretty deep into this uh, article, and there's layers of articles by this researcher in the AI field. Which are worth reading if you want to read. But the gist is that humans jump to the conclusion that AI is not going to be able to do tasks at human levels, or it's not moving as fast as maybe they, th- you know, as it is, because it, it's moving fast. It's moving fast, and I think that's that's the the you know the 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 call here is to just make you aware of that. This chart shows how fast things are scaling. It, it's pretty quick. Uh, the length of tasks AI can do is doubling every seven months. Explain what that means. Yeah, so they go into uh, you know stages of what it's doing at a human level, and they they measure right. these tasks by what it would take a human four minutes to do, and it's blowing it out of the water. Right. It's 100% human, success 100%. rate. And um, hours, like hours 50%. 50% and four hours, about a 10% success rate. And what's crazy, one of the articles that's in here uh, is from OpenAI and a project they call GDP Val, where they take 44 occupations. And by the way, the people they studied had an average of 14 years experience and had been had been elevated yeah, promoted, in, so, in their business. Yeah. And the gist of the article is, look, Within the next two years, these agents ought to be able to do a task that it would take a human a week to do from start to finish on its own, no human input, and do it 100 times faster. Like and, and, two and cheaper. years. <laughs> two years. Right. Right. Okay. So, yes, it's exponentially going very, very quickly. So, I think the point we're trying to make is look, that could be scary. Yeah. Oh, crud. Am I, I think it is scary for a lot yeah. of people. Yeah. So ultimately, and, and by the way, corporate America has never been in better shape from a financial standpoint. You know, if they save more money, it's just going to be that much better. So it's easy to get scared out, you know, and feel like, oh my gosh, things are going to be bad. Mm-hmm. Actually, you know, for a while, it ought to be I, decent. I, and that's why I think the push here is, own those businesses right, right? through stocks uh, cash is not going to treat you as well as how these businesses are going to you know uh, grow into this technology that's right and I mean if unemployment rises I mean if we get I mean where I'm surely there's a tipping point somewhere I don't know where it is right, right. I mean is it 15 percent unemployment that's still 85 percent employment just don't know it ought to be decent for stocks for a while yep